What's up guys and welcome back to a brand new Five Nights at Freddy's Security Reach video. As you guys know in the last video, we found all 16 CDs and we heard Vanny's pretty creepy backstory and we also found out that it's not just Vanny that's, you know, that was a part of those CDs. There's also somebody else that was in those therapy sessions and we don't know who. So there's a lot of lore being found right now and a lot of crazy stuff. We're going back in today because, well, we have more crazy stuff to find and uh, it includes, it's including the level 12 security doors or level 10 security doors. As you guys know, they're all around the map and they're locked off and nobody really knows, you know, what's behind them. Now, here's the thing. We're going to be finding them in today's video. We're going to be unlocking them in today's video, but I'm just going to say right off the bat, I heard that there isn't really anything in them like they're like hollow rooms so that leaves the question if they are hollow which we're gonna find out in today's video why are they hollowed out what are they gonna be used for these are things that i really wish steel wool would say something about because i think it's very strange that it's in the game but there's nothing in them if that is the case but we're gonna find out in today's video but of course you guys want a chance to win a copy of fnaf security breach all you have to do is simply leave a like on the video leave a comment down below saying whatever you want and hit that subscribe button it really is that simple and that easy and you can enter on multiple videos anyways let's go ahead and press play and hop back into the game all right so I want to continue for my save. I do have my glitched save down here, which what I mean by glitched is just simply if you pick up the head after the 6 a.m. mark in the end game, like where it's hardcore mode, where if you die, you lose everything and you can't save. If you pick up the head in Roxy's Raceway, you can actually save again and it just sets you back to 5 a.m., but it doesn't change anything else. It just lets you save and that's it. So here we go. All right, let's do this. This is going to be fun though, because we're going to be doing a lot of glitching in this video, which by the way, are you guys excited for the hacking videos? As you guys know, we did it with Poppy Playtime. We did it with Help Wanted when it was much harder to do, and we're going to be doing it with this game. So let me know if you guys are excited for that. I might do a video on it tonight, or we could do one tomorrow. I don't know, but I'm excited to be flying around through this map. I feel like it's only fair that you do it after you 100% complete the game or like do everything there is to do. So uh, that's why I waited until the very end of the series to obviously start the hacking videos, but it's going to be a lot of fun. All right, let's go ahead and start by heading over here. So, oh wait, where am I, by the way? Oh, I got to go this way i'm like running around back and forth i don't know where i am um I, which I, by the way i should know this entire layout which i do <laughs> because i spend so much time playing this game i know where everything is the layout of everything so sometimes i get a little mixed up but we gotta go in here first so if you guys remember there's this game that we played at the start what is that back there by the way what is that there's like something pink back there oh it's like the reflection it just looks weird it's like a disco ball or something but if you guys remember, we played this game at the start right here, where you enter these rooms, and it's very simple. Basically, Glamrock Freddy is on his way to save you. And uh, by the way, that's super suspicious how he says, like, he just randomly got a, a second wind. I still think that's weird. It's going to come up later on. But uh, the point is, there's these two doors right here. You got to shock the animatronics whenever they show up at them. But before you do that, you actually get this card right here. This is a security badge. Now, right now, we are level... What level are we? Level six. So I need to do this four times. And the reason that I have to do that is because I can't actually do the vent mini game down here. If you guys if you guys can see this part of the map that's white, that means I haven't been there yet. It's like a part of storyline I haven't done. And we have done it in a video. It's just like you slide down the vent and... Um, you get chased by There's music man and here. you have to do like the whole chica you have What's to make chica uh, a pizza Oops. and all that kind of stuff but currently Ooh. i don't know if they fixed it but it like broke my game completely so we're gonna do it this way instead so uh this is super easy to do regardless i'm just gonna do it quite a few times but i'll show you guys the first time and then the other times we'll just skip it and just get to the security badges so this is uh you know obviously you see glamrock freddy on the monitor see this is weird he said i don't I didn't think you could stand up, Glamrock Freddy. He said, oh, I consider it a second win. Don't you guys think that's very weird? Like, we know... Well, we don't know, but we think he's good. But I don't know. Oh, whoa, look at this. I forgot all about this. Since Monty was cut in half and we're at the end game, he's here, but he's cut in half. Oh, my God. Look at him crawling around out there. That is a cool attention to detail. That is cool, because they could have just had, like, normal Monty, and while people would have been like, oh, what, what happened? I thought I cut in half, but they, they actually added him in crawling around out there. Look at that. That is cool. All right, let's go ahead and beat this. Okay, okay, okay. I got you, Freddy. Let's go, Freddy. Do it. Let's do this. There you are. Okay. Yeah, I don't know why Vanny shows up and says that, because she doesn't actually show up here, which, by the way, don't you guys think it's weird? Oh, my God. Wait, why do I hear an animatronic besides them? All right. I'm waiting for them to, like, stomp on something. I can hear an animatronic. Okay, right here. This door? No, it's this one. Um, by the way, apparently Vanny was supposed to show up way more than she actually did. Like, apparently in the files or something, she's, like, bugged out. And that's why we don't see her. Which, that was one of the most disappointing things about the game. Where's Freddy at? Oh, there he is. Is the fact that, like, they advertised Vanny everywhere. And then she only shows up, like, twice in the game. But apparently that's on accident. So, yeah, they could update it to where uh, she'll actually, like, you can increase her meter to where she's supposed to show up, like, a lot more and actually chase you a lot more. So, uh, yeah, whenever they add that update into the game, you guys already know. I'm trying to find you, Freddy. 
Uh, you guys already know I'm definitely going to get back on the game, and uh, we're going to get chased by Vanny a lot because I'm looking forward to that. Okay, right here. I think they're on both sides. Are you on this side with the... Oh, wow, you're back on this side again. All right, get out of here, buddy. All right, Freddy, where you at, huh? Where you at, my friend? Let's go. Where? I'm trying to find you, dude. I've looked everywhere. Is someone banging on the door? Where are... Oh, I checked this one first. You just weren't there yet. Holy, who's screaming like that? Monty, calm down. Is he dead? I think we killed Monty. No, okay, he's moving a little bit. I thought we might have shocked him a little too much. Guy just stopped. Look, he's literally not moving. Oh, no. I think because he's chopped in half, he has, like, less health than usual or something. Oh, he just ran through that. Okay. Whatever, dude. I mean, we are, you know, glitching the game currently, so it makes sense. But, yeah, he just kind of ran right through that uh, security shutter. Should probably get that checked out, Freddy. I don't think you're supposed to be doing that. All right, where's the next one? Uh, no. Are you at the one I literally just looked at? Of course you are. Okay, that one. Go. Oh, is he? Whoa. Oh, okay. I thought we did something wrong. Escape through the vent. Okay, so do I actually have to escape? I don't know how this... Oh, yeah, it does. Oh, my gosh. I never noticed he actually does that. Okay, so we have to jump sorry. down into his hands. I didn't find any lift controls. All I found was this disc thing. This Follow thing? Me to the atrium. That is a program disc for the Oh, stage so since we bugged if everything out, this is one of the level 10 doors, by the way, should be able which to as soon as we drop down, we'll use it. Program, All right, so now that we did that, I'm going to do a save, but this is going to be a save that I... Uh, should we do it now? Yeah, in case I lose, I'm definitely going to have to do an existing slot. We're going to save over... Um, we need to do it on one that's like completely safe. Okay, December 16th. These are all like early on saves. Let's go ahead and get rid of... Ooh, wow, these are pretty split apart. This one right here, since they're only like 17 minutes apart in case I need to go back to it. Um, we're gonna do save slot number seven, all right? Yeah, save slot number seven, we need to remember that. All right, now I'm gonna continue to do this mini game, which is gonna take some time, because obviously I gotta run through the, the back of the uh, show stage. You guys will know exactly where I am whenever I come out, but I gotta run through all this about three more times, complete that about three more times, and then after that, we can then go inside of all the level 10 security doors. And if we wanna go to level 12, I mean, I can do it two more times, and we can do that, but I don't even know if there actually is a level 12 door. I just saw a picture someone sent me on Twitter of it. So, I don't know. We'll see what happens. Guys, look at this. I just got an achievement. And look, security breach. I didn't know how you got this. Get the highest security access possible. And I just got level 8. So, that tells you right there that, that level 8 is the highest you can go. But it's a steel wool. Why are there level 10 doors and level 12? Like I just, like I said earlier, they, they really need to like make a post addressing that. Like, say something about it. You can't just release a game and then just be like, oh, yeah, there's these doors here, but uh, okay, you but guys aren't allowed inside of them, and it's literally impossible to get inside them. Even if you do, apparently there's nothing there, but uh, they're there. <laughs> they're there. They're just, you know, mystery doors for right now. Like, I feel like they should say, like, oh, these are for DLC, or, like, not. They should, just, honestly, they should just get rid of the text that says, like, level 10, you know, required. They should just say, like, nothing whenever you walk up to them or something. I don't know. All right, guys, I just finished all of those uh, little missions up there. We now have level 10. So we're going to start by going into the first door that I see, which is this one right here. This is a level 10 door. But like I said, I don't think anything is going to be behind this, but we can hope. And uh, let's see. Okay, open. Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> yeah, I mean, a good thing I saved before doing this because what? What? I Wait, what just happened? What? What just what did I just do? Oh my. Whoa, that's weird. So wait, this leads to the Rockstar Row. But it like doesn't. Wait, that. Is that the same door? Hold on. Is that the door that I used to get upstairs? No. Wait. So these doors are accessible, but they're like. Yeah, that's not the other staircase door. That's weird. So. Why aren't these usable then? Steel wool. Like this is this could be a nice shortcut. I mean, I don't I would never use this because well, no, I think it still probably would be faster to run that way or like the other way. I don't know. It, it's just like a, a shortcut though. That is so strange. Cause like in the outside it looks like nothing. I wonder what the other doors lead to then. If anything, they maybe they're not for DLC, they're just for like, I don't know, shortcuts around the pizza plex that for whatever reason, Steel Wool just decided not to use. Actually, there's another one back here. Let's do this one. That is weird, though. Okay, let's go over here. So, look. It should just load. It just takes a second, and then you're in. Wow. All right. Let's go ahead and go to this security level 10 door over here. If I remember correctly, there should be one right here in front of me. Yeah, right here. So, let's see. Can I actually... Oh, can I get over this? No. I might be able to use Freddy. Let me... See. Oh, I can't use Freddy because he's... uh. 
He's injured. Oh, crap. That might actually break the game. That Well, good thing I did another save. Because, yeah, you have to take him uh, backstage or, like, under the stage. And you have to repair him before he's, like, callable again. So that could be a problem. Let me see. I don't think I can... Yeah, I can't use I'm him at all. Sorry, oh. Gregory. I am in no condition to carry you. Oh, I've never heard that voice line before. That might be a little new. I mean, maybe that's, like, a little hidden one. I mean, it's not hidden, but, you know, probably most people didn't use that. All right, let's go ahead. Oh, my gosh, my game. Holy, my game. All right, let's go ahead and go. Okay, my game. Please, game, help. <laughs> Stop freezing. All right, before we go down there and try that door again, let's go ahead and try this door over here. Because I remember for sure as a fact, there's a door over here <clears throat> that uh, I can use. Oh, GeForce Ready Game Driver is available. I wonder if they uh, did any update for, like, security breach on there, like, graphics-wise. Because right now, you literally can't use ray tracing on this game. It just, it slows down everything to the point where it, it's literally, like, unplayable. Um, well, at least on, like, max settings. All right, so if we go this way, I remember there's a door here. Yeah, this door right here. Staff only, level 10. All right, so if I tell you guys, this can't be a shortcut to the atrium, right? It's got to be a shortcut underground because why would you have a shortcut to the atrium from right here? Or it could be a shortcut upstairs, but then again, there's a staircase right there, so... All right. Oh, yep. We got a staircase. And wait, this actually loaded. Why aren't these usable? That's so weird. Like, I wonder what they're saving level 10 for. Like, the fact that they even show level 10 and, like, let you, like, not let you get to it, but they let you know it's there is weird. There's a door here. There's stuff under here. Yeah, all just, like, parts and service boxes. Oh, a Roxy plush. All right, is there anything, like, hidden back here, though? No. All right, let's go ahead and uh, try this. Oh, okay. We got another door. So this is going to be a shortcut to falling out of the map, or I don't want to... Okay, wait. No, this one actually leads to nothing. Oh, I fell out of the map. There. Oh, I landed, though. <laughs> I landed. Oh, what? 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 Oh, no. Okay, what is... The, what are these doors, dude? Oh, my gosh. What are these doors? So these have to all be shortcuts to, like... Yeah, they're, they're just shortcuts to the other areas. Like, that's a shortcut to underground. The other one was a shortcut to... um. The Rockstar Row. And that, yeah, okay. Well, I mean, there's still more, though, that we have to try, I think. I don't remember where the other ones are, but I'm pretty sure there's more. Let's go ahead. Let's just have a look around. We're, we're kind of have to, we're going to have to go from like area to area, really. I think there might be one in Chica's kitchen area down there, but I don't, I don't know for sure. I, I definitely want to try that one on Rockstar Row that we found. Oh my gosh, this guy's just cleaning. This guy's never done cleaning down here. All right, let's go ahead and head back up. Let's see if we can spot any other doors. Actually, wasn't there one? Oh, crap. I'm locked in here. Yeah, I'm, I can't get out of here because that requires Freddy. And I think the other side does too. I mean, I have a save right there. Let's just quit and reload that save. Luckily, I saved there. Oh, man. But either way, I don't think we're ever going to be able to use Freddy on that save, unfortunately. Okay, here it is right here. Save slot seven. All right, so here we go. This is like the ultimate bugged out save, though. We have like the save, uh, the save, save glitch, if that makes any sense. So we're, we're at 5 a.m. right now, or it's like 5.15. And then we have like level 10 security. We have everything that just like breaks the game. All right, let's go ahead and take this shortcut to Rockstar Row. Might as well. Oh my God, don't fall through the map. Okay, we're good. All right, let's check. Is there any other doors that were like locked away? I think there's one over here. I want to check back here because I think there is one. All right, let's go through here. Um, okay, so all these are normal doors. This door right here, though, yeah, it takes us to here. Okay, so I remember, yeah, there's a door right there, but I don't think you can even access that. I don't think you can't. No, you can't even. Yeah, this wouldn't open. And then there was, oh, no, I thought there, oh, my God, please don't. Okay, dude. Oh, no, you're going to spawn in Roxanne, bro. Leave me alone. I thought that was a door for the longest time. But that's just like a little roll-up thingy, whatever you call that thing. <laughs> I don't know. All right, I'm going to look around for some more doors, though. All right, guys, so quick little update. I just checked Rockstar Raceway or Roxy Raceway, and now I'm checking her, her uh, salon or saloon. Is it a salon or a saloon? I don't know. It's it got to be a salon. Yeah, it's a salon. But I'm checking these, and uh, so far, no luck with any doors. I honestly don't know if there are other doors. Someone sent me a picture of like a level 12 security access door, which the fact that that's level 12 is like, what does that, like, what even is that? <laughs> what could that possibly be used for? But uh, I think honestly, they're all just shortcuts and that's really it. But yeah, I've checked everywhere. Okay, so now I'm gonna head to, I would check Phaser Blast, but I don't think there's one down there just because like I said, I think they're all shortcuts. So there wouldn't be one in Phaser Blast unless it like connects to 
I don't know, something else underground, but I doubt it. Oh, guys, I just remember where there's one. Um, Monty's Gator Golf. I remember. Yeah, um, it was, it was, uh, when you go through the gator's mouth, I think. Like, in between the two bathrooms. I, I know where it is. Oh, no. Roxy, please, leave me alone. Roxy is the worst because you cannot get rid of her. Like, if she gets on you, you just have to run away. And, like, that's it. You can't... I don't think you can hit her with this because she doesn't have eyes. It has to hit him in the eyes. Same thing with the camera. It has to hit him in the eyes. That's why it doesn't work on Monty because he has glasses on. Well, like, Monty... Well, no, actually, yeah, I think Monty's the same way. You can't use anything on him. Actually, before we go down there, is there a door in between? Because I know they like to put him in between the... Oh, there is. Okay, so this one, if it's another staircase... Ooh, whoa. Okay, this is different. Hold on, let me bring out my flashlight. So maybe they just didn't have enough time to finish the rooms? That's my best guess, like these extra rooms, like, cause I think they're pretty pressed for time. Look, there's a gate down there. All right, let's do this one first. I think that one's gonna shoot me out of the map or take me underground again. So let's do this one first and then we'll come back and do that one. But yeah, I think these were just like little shortcuts and they just maybe ran out of time. But then again, now that they say level 10 security access, they're gonna have to update the game to add more like challenges to get the last two badges because right now the only way to get this is if you bug the game at least i think because literally it says in the achievements level h the top security badge so take the level 10 yeah there i think at some point there it's either going to be dlc which i don't think they would do it that way unless it's free dlc because then you're like you know paying to get you know shortcuts or they're just going to add an update at some point that just adds in more mini games like more survival things like that i don't know all right, so this one should be... Oh, my gosh. Leave me alone, bro. Please don't spawn in, Roxy. Go away. Okay, it should be right here. Yeah, this door right here. All right, let's see. Oh, crap. That doesn't look promising. <laughs> this this door does not look promising at all. I will just say that, okay? But, oh, boy. All right, let's... Uh, oh, I really don't want to do this. Please don't fall through the map. Let me just give it a second, see if it loads anything. What is that? The elevator? Yeah, that's the elevator. I don't know where this could be a shortcut to. Oh, man. Please don't fall off the map. Okay, the door closed. We're now outside. And there we go. Are we going? No, we're going all the way down. Oh, no. Where to, oh, okay. It saved me. It took me. Oh, wait. I think I know where. I, oh, my gosh. It took me back here. Maybe this is where this is supposed to lead back to. I don't know. That one definitely, it, it just saved me because I could tell I was like falling out of the map and it just put me, you know, wherever the, the closest area was, I guess, down there which is here. I don't know. That one's weird though. All right. So we got to go back over to Monty's, which I think I'm pretty close to because we're here. But yeah, we got to go back into Monty's, go through that other door and uh, probably fall through the map again. If I had to take a guess, I'm fine with falling through the map as long as I'd rather it be endless than go back underground because that's going to be a pain to get out of there. Then again, like I said, I could just reload a save, but all right. So here we are. I don't remember where there's any other doors though. So this might be the last one. Okay, so through here we go. This one's at least interesting, though. It's like a staircase. It's got to be for, like, underground. The only thing is there's nothing here. So, like, I don't want to just... Uh, we're going to fall through the map again. Oh, no, there, there's a staircase here and a door. Oh. Oh, Roxy said something. What does that say? Oh, out of order. Is there anything crazy down here besides underground tunnel? There's something over... Oh, crap, dude. I missed... Oh, where am I? Oh, it's loading it. I'm underground. Yeah. Oh, wait, what? I know where we are. Yeah, we're, we're towards the endos. Okay, that's pretty bad when I can literally tell exactly where I am falling through the map. Yeah, we're, this is on the way to the endos down here. Okay, so maybe that's a shortcut to here. Because look, this is here and it says out of order. Yeah, maybe all of the out of order gates are eventually going to be opened for like quicker ways to like get to areas. Oh, so that takes us underneath Monty's is this. Okay. Let me recharge my flashlight and then we'll head in there. I got to be very careful with these guys because they are active. All right. If you guys didn't know, they are moving around down here. All right. So let's see. I don't remember there being any level 10 doors down here, but let's have a look around because like it's been a while since I've been down here. Well, it hasn't been that. <laughs> it feels like it's been like days since I've been down here, but I forgot like security reach just came out like a few days ago, which is pretty crazy. Okay. He shouldn't turn around because yeah, he takes a long time to turn around. I've messed around with these guys enough to kind of, you know, how, know how they work. All right, so this is the scariest part to check. Let's, we're gonna start with this. All right, party, yep, and there we go. Okay, those guys are gonna activate now, we're good. All right, so, which by the way, if you guys didn't know, um, you can hide inside these, these little like laundry things, 
and the endos will all just run past you like i didn't know that i thought they would know where you are but yeah they actually do lose you all right so this is this room nothing in here at all let's go okay yeah nothing here gotta be careful out here though okay they're right there all right let's go ahead and activate these guys i want to check that main daycare room if you guys remember where uh oh crap all right we're gonna go ahead and use this deactivate all of them luckily it's a little bit easier with uh this stuff oh crap i feel like i might have missed a few gotta be very careful here okay press the button and continue now those are all active right yeah i'm just gonna start blasting over there <laughs> all right i want to check this daycare room up here and if there's nothing in here then i'll just show you guys the uh the secret all right or not the secret the hiding inside the hamper thing why do i hear endos all right so these guys won't activate oh my god what is that is roxy i can hear roxy crying from in here that's weird where is she at that you can hear her she must be above me somewhere i don't know all right let's go ahead and uh, let me show you guys this um so if i go ahead and hide in here see how close they are okay now hopefully yeah see look on the cams all right so there i am right there you can see gregory look at them they just stand there now they should yeah they'll start moving and if you have like the whole daycare out they'll all move in like a line like a huge line you remember the rexer and daco saw it and it was pretty funny but you don't have that many of them here so yeah that's kind of weird like if you're not nearby they just move on their own do their own thing that's about it really yeah just kind of walk around <laughs> i'm gonna hop out of this thing let me get out okay um oh wait, oh my god which side are they on okay all right well guys i think i'm gonna end this video here okay um in the next video we'll just find the other doors if there are any let me know if you guys know of any locations if you know where they are comment the location down below uh let me see Do these guys jump no they don't jump scare you when they're deactivated but yeah comment the exact location of where the door is so if it's in like rockstar row which we've already been to but um just use that, uh, that as an example if it's in there just put like rockstar row next to you know this next to monty or something like that just so i know like a, a you know general idea of where they are and we'll check them out in the next video anyways i hope you guys enjoyed leave a like if you did hit subscribe if you're new and i'll see you guys in the next one thank you guys so much for watching peace out